హలో ఐమ్ డాక్టర్ హరీష్ కన్సల్టెంట్ సర్జికల్ ఆంకాలజిస్ట్ కేఎంసి హాస్పిటల్స్ మ్యాంగ్లూర్ టుడే ఐఎమ్ గోయింగ్ టు స్పీక్ అబౌట్ కొలానిక్ క్యాన్సర్ ఇట్ ఈస్ వన్ ఆఫ్ ది కామనెస్ట్ క్యాన్సర్స్ ఇన్ ఎల్డర్లీ పాపులేషన్ ఆల్ ఓవర్ ద వరల్డ్ ద కామన్ రిస్క్ ఫ్యాక్టర్స్ ఫర్ కొలోరెక్టల్ మ్యాలిగ్నెన్సీస్ ఆర్ వన్ ఈజ్ ఏజ్ ఇట్స్ కామన్లీ సీన్ ఇన్ ఎల్డర్లీ పాపులేషన్ అండ్ ద కామన్ డయటిక్ డైటరీ ఫ్యాక్టర్స్ ఆర్ ఆల్సో ఇన్వాల్వ్ లైక్ పేషెంట్ people who are consuming high fat diet low fiber diet and uh, consuming red meat are known to have higher incidence of uh, colonic cancers and uh, any family history of colonic cancers especially in, with genetic mutations where uh, can be familial syndromes like uh, uh, familial uh, polyposis syndromes hnpcc lynch syndrome there are many syndromes which are linked to colonic cancers in increased uh, consumption of alcohol cigarette smoking inflammatory bowel diseases like ulcerative colitis crohn's disease what are the signs and symptoms of uh, colonic cancer most of the patients present with bleeding per rectum or uh, malina where most of the patients will be undergoing treatment for uh, hemorrhoids or piles so where they present in the later stage of the disease the other common signs and symptoms are anemia loss of weight loss of appetite uh, abdominal distension uh, omitting so when these signs and symptoms are there especially in elderly population it is important to consult an oncologist the common tests to diagnose colonic cancers are colonoscopy or sigmoidoscopy and biopsy depending on your signs and symptoms once you diagnose with colonic cancer then we have to stage the colonic cancer where we we are uh, considering you for uh, imaging either ct scan or uh, mri not all patients require pet scan as a tool to identify metastatic disease in uh, colonic cancers once you diagnose and uh, stage the disease the next step is to consider the treatment the main treatment in colonic cancer will be surgery if it is not metastatic early stage where we consider either stage 1 or stage 2 or advanced stage is stage 3 the metastatic disease even in metastatic disease the survival in colonic cancer is very good the patients whom we diagnose col- colonic cancer will undergo surgery either minimally invasive that is robotic or laparoscopic or can be considered as open surgery once the patient undergoes surgery patient may require chemotherapy after the surgery that is called adjuvant therapy depending on the stage of the disease not all patients of rectal cancers or colonic cancer require a stoma bag so nowadays the the need of stoma bag has come down and most of the patients won't require a permanent stoma bag most of the times the salient feature of this colonic cancer is even in metastatic setting there is role of surgery many of the patients who are also metastatic are known to live long with uh, good survival where we can consider neoadjuvant chemotherapy and if the lesion in the metastatic setting is operable and completely removable we can consider surgery as a curative option in metastatic setting also in colonic cancers nanage 2017 na ನವಂಬರ್ ನಲ್ಲಿ ಸ್ವಲ್ಪ ಹೊಟ್ಟೆ ನೋವು ಕಾಣಿಸ್ಕೊಳ್ತು ಆಮೇಲೆ ಮೋಷನ್ ಸರಿಯಾಗಿ ಆಗ್ತಾ ಇರಲಿಲ್ಲ ಸುಮಾರು ಒಂದು ದಿನಕ್ಕೆ ಒಂದು ಇಪ್ಪತ್ತೈದರಿಂದ ಮೂವತ್ತು ಸರಿ ಮೋಷನ್ ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ಆಮೇಲೆ ಬಾವನ ಹತ್ರ ಎಲ್ಲ ಮಾತಾಡಿ ಬಾವ ಅಂದರು ಕೆ ಎಮ್ ಸಿ ಮಂಗಳೂರಿಗೆ ಹೋಗೋಣ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಕಿಮೋಥೆರಪಿ ಮತ್ತು ರೇಡಿಯೇಷನ್ ಸುಮಾರು ಇಪ್ಪತ್ತೆಂಟು ಕಿಮೋ ಇಪ್ಪತ್ತೆಂಟು ರೇಡಿಯೇಷನ್ ಮಾಡಿದ್ರು ಡಾಕ್ಟರ್ ಹರೀಶ್ ಸರ್ ಆಂಕಾಲಜಿ ಸರ್ಜನ್ ಅವರು ಅವರು ಸರ್ಜನ್ ಸರ್ಜರಿ ಮಾಡೋದು ಅಂತೇಳಿ ಫಿಕ್ಸ್ ಆಗಿತ್ತು ಮೂರುವರೆ ತಿಂಗಳು ಆದಮೇಲೆ ಮತ್ತೆ ಮತ್ತೆಲ್ಲ ಟೆಸ್ಟ್ ಮಾಡಿ ಅಷ್ಟೊತ್ತಿಗೆ ಆಪ್ರೇಷನ್ ಮಾಡಿದ ಬಯೋಪ್ಸಿ ರಿಪೋರ್ಟ್ ಬಂದಿತ್ತು ಬಯೋಪ್ಸಿ ರಿಪೋರ್ಟಲ್ಲಿ ಕ್ಯಾಲ್ಸ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ಸರ್ ಸೆಲ್ಸ್ ನಿಲ್ಲ ಅಂತ ಬಂದಿತ್ತು ಐದು ಲಕ್ಷ ಕಮ್ಮಿ ಕ್ಲೋಸರ್ ಅಂತೇಳಿ ಮತ್ತೊಂದು ಆಪ್ರೇಷನ್ ಮಾಡಿ ಬ್ಯಾಗ್ನ ತೆಗೆದು ತೆಗೆದು ಈಗ ಈಗ ನಾನು ಪರವಾಗಿಲ್ಲ ಈಗ ನಾರ್ಮಲ್ ಆಗಿದ್ದೀನಿ ವೈದ್ಯ ನ